Hey guys, it's Dami and I'm going to be doing a product review on Theratree Tea Tree Scrub. And this is the product right here. I received this free to review and I'm going to tell you, I, I honestly like this product. I mean, this is a product that I definitely would not mind buying again. And as a matter of fact, um, I'm actually going to be purchasing a few more for some family members. Um, I, I kind of wish I would have received this a long time ago because this would have been an excellent stocking stuffer um, or just like a gift basket. You know, I'm one of those people that like to make my own gift baskets for people. So anyway, this is a, um, a therapeutic exfoliating scrub and it helps scrub away fungus, bacteria, bad odors, dead skin cells, calluses. Um, use it like once to tw one to two times a week. Now, I am going to say one thing I did notice about this product. Uh, I've used other scrubs in the past. I am going to say one of the good things is that you do not need to use a lot. There are some scrubs that I have, and it seems like I have to use a lot just to, um, you know, really cleanse my skin, should I say. Um, this you only need a little bit. However, it seems to dry my skin out, which I'm kind of surprised because it does have a lot of um, essential oils. So, for example, some of the key ingredients include natural pumice, activated charcoal, diatomaceous earth, nourishing botanicals, tea tree oil, neem oil, jojoba oil, and white willow bark. Now, for those of you guys that got that, I probably went a little bit too fast. Um, I do want to say one of the things that I did realize, because I didn't really um, check out the key ingredients the first time I used this product, so I was like, why is my skin dried out? And I have combination skin, and so sometimes my skin will be really oily, and then there's sometimes my skin will be really dry. For example, today, my skin seems really, really dry. It's gloomy outside. It's kind of rainy, um, but yeah, my skin's really dry today. But I just want to say, because I don't think a lot of people understand that sometimes when you have products, um, certain, excuse me, when you have certain ingredients in a product, um, I guess like they're kind of, they'll kind of like, I guess counteract or, you know, however you say it. Um, but one of the things I do have to say, anybody, um, if you guys know about diatomaceous earth, um, it's a very popular product. It's getting popular as time goes on, but um, it's it's it dries you out. And I actually have a huge bag of the of food grade diatomaceous earth. And when that stuff gets on my hands, I mean my hands get so dry. And it's one of those products that you don't want to keep it on your skin. It will dry your skin out. Um, so diatomaceous earth, it 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 will dry it up. Okay, which I'm going to tell you something, if you guys have like pimples and stuff on your face, get you some diatomaceous earth, make a little paste, and put it like just on your face, and it will draw out all that stuff, just, just to let you know. But, um, and another thing, pumice. I mean, there's ingredients in here that will dry your skin out um, and strip those oils. So while you would assume that they have like other oils such as tea tree, neem, jojoba, um, you know that you really wouldn't have to worry about that it, it this seems like a product that you kind of do it's um I, I mean i can't speak for everybody because then again everybody's skin is different um but i know for me this product seems to dry my skin out more which is you know not that i'm worried i mean when i get out the shower i'm gonna put lotion on anyway um but i did notice that it's much drier um than other scrubs that i have used so um, let's see. So I'm going to just go ahead and show you guys a little bit about what this looks like. Um, and it's, ooh, oh, well, it came out. It smells so good, though. I really love the smell. So as you guys can see, this is the product. And it really does have that smoky, um, charcoal look. Um, it's very light. I have to say it is very light. Um, but it definitely is exfoliating. I mean, very gritty. But I love the fact it's not a thick product. Back up. I love the fact that it's not um, a thick product at all. Um, so, the end result, I really like this product. Honestly, um, I wish I would have gotten this like maybe, you know, a week or two earlier because I definitely would have ordered this, um, you know, for some people. This makes an excellent stocking stuffer. This just makes an excellent, I like to um, pre-make baskets for people for the holidays um i'm not one of those people who like to go out and just buy pre-made baskets i don't know i just i guess i like to um personalize it as they say so this would have been a perfect gift um but anyway i'm gonna order some more um 
And like I said, this you don't need to use a lot, and you only use it once or twice a week. You don't want to use this every single day. That's something you need to um, be mindful of. Um, you don't want to over exfoliate your skin, and I know tons of people who exfoliate every single day. You're actually harming your skin. You're not doing it any good to exfoliate every single day. Um, but anyway, um, I love this product. I, I definitely think it's a great product. Like I said, the only issue that I had um, with this is that it, dried, it seemed to dry my skin out more. Um, but as far as um, the after effects, I mean, my skin did feel smoother during the day. Um, and so, you know, it did compensate for that. But the last thing I'm going to go over before um, I finish this review is all the ingredients. I've noticed um, when a lot of people are doing reviews, one of the main things people kind of look for now, and, and you know, people are more, um, you know, serious about the the type of ingredients that they're putting in their bodies as well as on their bodies and you do have to remember whether it's a lotion a cream or a scrub i mean you have pores so these ingredients are still getting into your body and so um i'm going to go ahead and read all the ingredients if some of them i can't pronounce i apologize because i don't know all those scientific names um but for the most part i'm going to go ahead and read the ingredients so that way um, if there's an ingredient here that maybe you're allergic to, there are some natural oils that people are allergic to or, or um, natural ingredients. So at least you'll know. Um, so, okay. So the first ingredient is water. Then it's pumice, um, glycerin, which, which is kosher, um, disoglucoside, um, propanidinol, propen, diatomaceous earth. Um, that right there helps me understand why this drives my skin out. Glycerin, which any of you guys use glycerin soap, knows that um, it will dry your skin out. It strips that, um, glycerin soap strips those oils, that those dead skin cells off. Very drying. Diatomaceous, diatomaceous earth, the same thing. Um, so there we go. Um, diatomaceous earth, melaleuca, um, alternifolia tea tree oil. Um, that's funny because as you guys know, I'm a, a member of, um, Melaleuca Wellness. <laughs> so it's just seeing that is so funny. Um, so anyway, tea tree oil, eucalyptus oil, um, organic, um, it's just neem oil, um, coconut oil, uh, jojoba oil, safflower oil, uh, olive fruit oil, hemp seed oil, sunflower oil, peppermint oil, white willow bark extract, activated charcoal, spearmint oil, um, xanthan gum, caprylo-glycol, menthol, potassium sorbate, caprylohydroxamic acid, acid. Anyway, and then sodium benzoate. <laughs> That's why I don't like reading reading ingredients, because I get stumped on a long word like that. Um, but anyway, that, those are the ingredients um, in here. So, um, but yeah, and what I'll do is, if you are interested in purchasing this, I will um, put, the, uh, put the direct link to their website to purchase the product as well as amazon.com um but yeah so i mean that's the um that's my review and they have other products by the way um they have because when i uh, applied for the the um to review the product they had different products out there and then um you know they sent you one of them but they have a soap um a foot soak and um lotion and so honest to be honest with you i was so excited that they sent me the scrub because when i saw that i was like i really want the scrubs so i think they were reading my mind i swear but um anyway i definitely want to um you know thank the company and by the way the company is um um olivine or olivine olivine i don't really know how to pronounce it. i don't want to say it wrong um that's a name of the company the um the line of products is therotree and so i definitely want to thank the company for um you know letting me review their product absolutely loved it um so again thank you and thank you guys for um watching and stay tuned for more videos